Where'd that guy go? They're bad. They're bad. They're all bad. What are you doing, dude? What's wrong with you, bro? Oh, jeez. Big boy got hands. What's going on, this is Johnny, and welcome back to Mafia 2 Definitive Edition. We're playing Chapter 9 today. Do I say we just get up in here and see what we can get into with Chapter 9? When we last left on Chapter 8, we had to go kill some of those greasers. So, I want to see what we can do. I'm probably going to finish the game today. Um, I think there's like four more chapters after, after this. I think it's only a 13 chapter game, so... We will see, plus, plus we got DLC as well, so there's still a lot of content we gotta do, plus Mafia 3 and all its DLC. We have a lot of stuff that we can still do. Um, plus Man Eater. Hello. Yeah, Vito, we got a situation here. Grab a gun and meet me at the bar, and make sure you're driving a decent set of wheels. Okay. All right, I'll be right there. Head to the Maltese Falcon. Someday. All right, let's go ahead and go like this. That door. Open the I keep going right. I keep thinking that we're at uh, Joe's apartment still. Open up, police. Police are here, huh? Listen, we know you're in there. Oops. Got to keep going downstairs. Right. Uh, shoot. Uh, I think I think we used this car last time, didn't we? Pretty sure we did. Yeah, let's go ahead and get in it. It's not very fast, I can tell you that. All right, we are pulling up right now. Brought us park right here, to be honest. And then, actually, I should have parked over here, shouldn't I have? That's all right, though. Okay, let's go ahead and jump in here. See what we can get into. What's, what's Joe Morning, want, about of all things? Hey, Vito. I'd like to introduce you to somebody. Vito, this is Carlo Falcone. Pleasure to meet you, Mr. Falcone. Vito? So, Vito, how do you feel about Alberto Clemente and Luco Gorino? Well, honestly, Mr. Falcone, the way I see it, those assholes tried to steal 5,000 bucks from me and then left me to rot in jail. That's good, because the two of them are planning to make a move on us. So it looks like we're going to have to do something before they do something. Eddie will tell you the rest. I'm sure you won't let me down. Goodbye, Mr. Falcone. Nice to meet you, Vito. What the hell's going on? A car with three of our guys in it disappeared last night. And word around town is that Luca might have had something to do with it. Who's missing? Harvey Beans and the two guys who were supposed to be protecting him, Tony Balls and Frankie the mm -hmm. Mick. Yeah. Beans is Carlo's accountant. If he talks, we're all fucked. What do you need me to do? I need you to wait for him in front of Freddy's and follow him to find out if he's involved. And then? If you find out that he had anything to do with this, you whack the bastard. And if any of our guys is still alive, try and rescue him. Hopefully you can find him before they spill the beans about our operation. Okay. Where do you think he'll go? I got no idea. So go prepared. Make sure you've got a fast car and some firepower. All right, no problem. Okay, stop by here when you're done. And Vito, don't tell nobody about this. Got it. All right, so I guess we should have probably run, run a faster car. Because this car right here is not fast whatsoever. Um. I'm not sure what we should do here. Should we go get a different car or... I think one of these cars right here should do. What do you guys think? Um. Let's use this one. Alright, I, th I think we can go ahead and make it our way over there now because... This thing should be fast enough. Look how fast these things are. Woo! This thing moves, bro. You can feel it when you freaking push the trigger and even go. All right, we are at Freddy's now. So let's this see what we can get car. into. Now, where are you, Luca? There you are. Okay, here we go. Shouldn't get too close. I gotta make sure Luca doesn't see me. Follow Luca, don't let him see you. Okay. Taking a right. Is 
doing a big ass square or what? Okay, doing still pretty good right now. Just taking a left. I can't like floor it because I'll catch up to him pretty quick. So it's gonna be kind of annoying with the audio. Okay, he's taking a right down here. We gotta go pretty quick now. He's getting away. Right, there he is. Yo, this thing caps out on with A on the accelerator. Riverside. Put this little ac the stop accelerator thing down. Taking it right. Where's this guy going? Man, where's this guy going? Like on the back side of this place. You would think he would hear us. Slaughterhouse, of course. Looks like Eddie was right. Okay. We gotta get in there without being seen. Okay. Find a way to sneak into the, the slaughterhouse. Go around this guy because you never know. Okay, it looks like there's a there's a freaking like little opening right here. So I'm thinking maybe we gotta go this way. No, okay, that's not right either. All right, we gotta go that way somehow. So let's see if we can run over here. And maybe get in this way. Uh, excuse me. Yeah, can I help you? You know how to get into the slaughterhouse over here? And, uh, what would you be looking for in there? Yeah, my dog ran in there. I'm trying to find him. Your dog, huh? Yeah. You know how to get inside or what? First of all, let me tell you something. You are a terrible liar. And second of all, unless your dog has keys to that building, the only way he could have got in is through the sewer. Sewer, huh? All right, thanks. All right, so it was this place over here then. It was the sewer. I kind of figured that's why there's a big opening over here. It's from back over here. Where'd that guy go? They're bad. They're bad. They're all bad. What are you doing, dude? What's wrong with you, bro? Looks what like is freaking wrong off. with you? Boom. Got it. Oh my god, right in the sewers. <coughs> Jesus Christ, that reeks. Ugh. Hey, you know what, right? Gosh, this is disgusting. Dude, you know it's someone's job to do this, which is fine, you know? Working on a five, do what you gotta do, but that's gross. Shit, that dog could be a problem. Ugh. Keep on going here. Left or right, I wonder. Fuck. Gross. There's a magazine in here. Might as well grab that while I'm here. You could just stop by to pick up some sticks. I'm gonna kill. Ooh, boy. Ugh. But we're getting paid overtime for this because this is awful. Okay, we got a. I'm gonna guess this is, this is a sneaking mission. Go ahead and use a ladder. Make our way up. We need silence guns. Ugh, look at my suit. Or my freaking clothes. Okay, don't go get seen. Jesus, would you shut up? What, is somebody there? There's nobody there, see? 
So shut up before we turn you into meatloaf. Lousy mutt. Shit, there they are. Now I got you, you skinny little prick. So what do I gotta do? What's my objective? Don't get seen or, or Falcons guys will be killed. Okay, so I just gotta let them go. So those are the dudes that Falcon was talking about. Okay, time to move. Find a way to sneak into the slaughterhouse. Okay, probably up this way if I had to guess. Yes. Up that way. Probably jump on this. And this. And now we're in. Do not shit, shoot, or those guys are kills. Okay, well, this guy's sleeping, so we should probably be all right there. Okay, nothing there. Just trying to make sure I don't see. Okay. Different guys, find out, find out where they're being held. How am I going to get in there without shooting people? All right, here we go. Oh, my God. Okay. Okay, we can't go this way. We have to go this way, maybe. Keep on going. Keep on going. Go around these guys. Go around this guy. He don't he don't see us? We're good still. We're still good. We can't go that way. Hey, you two. Shift's over. What do you mean shift's over? You got shit in your ears? I said you done it today. But I ain't done town on the beef steak. Don't make me say it again. Shift's over. Get the hell out of here. All right, fine by me. Damn Come on. Straight. Go faster, please. I got I got to try to hurry up before they, before those guys get back from the for those guys get and see those the other dude. Okay, sneak this way. Yeah, be right there. Okay. Fuck my own son, Boom, got it. Know Let's go. I know where you got the money. Falcone thinks he's got a good racket going, but he ain't gonna get away with it. Come on, how'd you get him into the state? I don't know anything. I'm just an accountant. Don't fuck with me, you egghead bastard. You wanna end up just like your buddy here? Come on, take a good look. You think you're tougher than him? After we're done with you, we're gonna grind you up in one of these machines here. <laughs> it's it's just a question of whether I'm gonna that guy's face? to fucking kill you first. <laughs> uh, hey, what's that fucking stench? Oh. Hey, hey, somebody's Drop over him. there. Hey, who the fuck are you supposed to be? Jesus Christ, what what is Captain Shipbag here to save the day? Shut the fuck up, Luca. Hey, I know you. You're the chump who was hanging around with that moron, Barbaro. I thought you were still ratting in the can. What the fuck you think you're doing here? Falcone sent me. He isn't too fond of skinny little cocksuckers trying to turn his guys into mincemeat. So, you joined up with Falcone, huh? Well, I'll tell you what. If you knew what was really going on, you'd realize that you was better off in jail. But that don't matter now anyway. Oh, jeez. Big boy got hands. Uh. That boy just eats him. Ow, dad takes it. Well, let me guess I gotta punch this guy. Oh my god, this dude's got big ass hands. Come on. Gotta keep we got weak in his defenses. One more time. Okay. Bada bing. Two hits, and then I gotta hit him. One more. Bada bing. Bada boom. Give me these freaking Floyd Floyd Mayweathers right here. Little McGr McGregor's. Come on. Come on, baby. Oh, that had to hurt. 
Oh my god, he hit so hard, dude. God, he hit so hard. If I could just... There we go. I need a good camera angle. One more. Boom. What? Come on. Such a long freaking fight right here. Here we go. Here we go. If I get that good camera angle, it's not bad, but I can't see if he's gonna hit that with the left. You know? Here we go. Stay right here so I can see you. Boom. What? I hit him so many times. I hit B there. Where are you going, dude? Are you freaking? If I die because of this, I'm gonna be so pissed off. Dude, are you joking? Come back over here. One more hit, we're pretty much done. One more. Okay. Boom, got him. Finally! I did that last time, it didn't take it. Oof. He has a freaking axe now? Or a meat cleaver? Got him. Got him. Boys, take care of him. Okay. There we go. Doing good so far. Get me down, will you? Thanks, Vito. We owe you one. I can't get him down. Yeah, he noticed he was a couple of guys shy at roll call. Shit. Poor Frankie. I'm gonna kill that son of a bitch. Beans, stay here and don't come out until we come get you. Okay, okay. Just don't forget about me. Okay, fellas? You got it, sir. All right, let's go ahead and get this ammo. Oh, oh, oh! oh shit, there he is. You better kill I was trying to give a hunt cover. That didn't work out too much, did it? Oh my god. Boom. All right, this time, getting ready with a shotgun. Shit. Poor Frankie. I'm gonna kill that son of a bitch. Beans, stay here and don't come out until we come get you. Come on in here, sirs. Boom. Boom. Come on in here, dude. I'm gonna get this work on you. Bada bing. Took him out. Now, this time I was ready. <laughs> All right, let's go. All right, where we, where we gotta go, though? Little cocksucker's gonna piss his pants. They are. And guess who's next? A lot of guys with a lot of thoughts are on their way over. Shit, too late. Here they come. Really? Can't hit this guy. Shit! 
Oh god, using the F word, huh? All right. That's a little bold of you. Oh my god, that was gonna hit that guy before he got out there. And he blows that freaking shotgun quick, doesn't he? Bada bing. Bada boom. I'll show you who you're fucking with, kid. Cover me. Hurry up. Okay. So two more. Go ahead and reload this Tommy gun real quick. One more to go. Where are you at in here? All right. Bottom nice boom. job. Now let's go get that little cocksucker. Let's do it. Before he makes any more fucking phone knock, calls. Knock, knock. Come on. Let me in. Something gonna happen with uh that guy? I forgot his name, Steve? That's not right, right? Steve's not it. Oh, Let me up there then. Shit. I ain't gonna be able to open it like this. Yeah, we need something heavy like a like a battering ram. I know. We'll use that cart. Do you not have a window? You can't just you can't leave. Why would you be just waiting for your death like that? You know. So fucking smart. Think you're so fucking smart, huh? Go ahead, try. Son of a bitch. What's he doing over there? Stop taking the freaking the wood planks. Come here, you fuck. Leave me alone. Like no, 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 okay. Jeez. I'm gonna have a little fun with Luca before I grind him up. Wanna join me? Uh, thanks for the invitation, but I think I'll pass it. Uh, uh, huh? No, just hate the sight of Luca. I hear you, but you're missing out. I think I'm gonna try out that cattle prod he was yapping about. Uh, yeah. Eddie wanted me to take care of him personally. Don't worry about that. It'll just take a little longer this way. This fuck don't deserve a quick death. I can't argue with that. Okay, I'm gonna go. I stink like an outhouse. I gotta get cleaned up. And tell Eddie he don't gotta worry about Luca. Yo, Beans, open the door. It's all over. You? You're still alive? Yeah. What'd you expect? Look, before we go home, you want to give me a hand with Sleeping Beauty here? You know, that's not such a bad idea. All right, we got to go take... Um... So let's go ahead and get my car. Will, it, will this open? We have to go back and see Eddie. Oh, we, we can't. Okay, sick. Uh, where's my car? Oh my God, thank God. Jeez. This car is worth a lot of freaking money. Smith 34 hot rod Bro, this thing goes so freaking fast. All right, we have to go that way long ride ahead of us I'm gonna go ahead and uh, drive out there. I'll see you guys in just a second I'm gonna cut right when we pretty much get there like usual You guys don't need to see all this driving Nothing really happens anyway All right, we are here Let's See what we can get into with this. Oh, he smells so bad. And he's going, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh Jesus Christ, was that you? Vito? Oh Jesus, why didn't you take a fucking bath before you came back? You told me to come right back when I was done. You think I'm enjoying this? Okay, 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 what happened with Luca? It's done. All right, how about our guys? You find them? Yeah, Luca had him in the slaughterhouse. Frankie's dead, but balls and beans are fine. Luca was, uh... Interrogating them when I got there. Any witnesses? Well, except for a dozen or so of Luca's whoa. bodyguards who hey, ran back, into nobody. Back up, okay? It was rough, Eddie. Yeah, it sounds like it got pretty hairy. But hey, you pulled it off and you got out of there in one piece, right? So go get cleaned up before you ruin everybody's appetite. And burn those fucking clothes you're wearing. My God. 
Five thousand dollars? Are you serious? We got five G's? Okay, so, so I, I think we should go to a clothing store. Why not, right? There's one right here. So let's go ahead and go there. We got five G's. Let's go on a, let's go on a spending spree, shall we? Let's go get some nice clothes. If you don't know me in my, if you don't know me in real life, I like I like clothes. I'm a huge clothes person. So I can't wait till we get bigger with this channel. I got so many sick ideas for clothing. Uh, for like a clothing brand I want to open up. So be on the lookout for that eventually because I got like all the stuff drawn out. You know what I, what I want on the clothes, all that stuff. I know I'm just gonna call it the you know. Actually, I'm not gonna give you details. We gotta wait till we get bigger. And then once we get bigger, we are ready to rock. Because I have all of that stuff ready to roll before I'm not getting, before we even get there. All right, so we got shirts. We got leather jackets, casual suit and raincoat. Uh, that one, we have black one. That. All right, so we got a pretty good amount of... I think we go all black. I say we go... I said we go with this, the black one right here. Looks great on you, sir. And see, yeah, I'll black that, looking like a boss. All right, let's go. Let's go back to Fal Falcone. Hey, Vito, you made it. Hey, Eddie. Oh, nice threads. Thanks. So, uh, what's the plan, fellas? Let's get the suits. <clears throat> Vito, Mr. Falcone is gonna bring us into the family tonight. You and me, we're gonna be made. No oh, shit. Tonight? Yeah. Really? Why didn't you tell me before? What do we gotta do? You'll find out. But first, there's somebody who'd like to have a little word with you. Leo, good to see you. What are you doing here? <laughs> hey, kiddo. Oh, that's the guy from prison. I want to talk to you about what's going to happen today. Come here, have a seat. All right. <sighs> sure. And hey, thanks again for doing whatever you did to get me out of the can early. Now I make good on my second promise to you. Second promise? Yeah. I told you the next time we opened the books, we'd recommend you, didn't I? Now it's done. You had something to do with this, but you work for Frank Vinci. Yeah. I would have liked to have had you in our family, but I figured Joe there is your best friend. You guys grew up together, just like me and Frank. And since Joe was working for Carlo the whole time you were inside, I recommended they take you in too when he got made. Thanks, Leo. I, I don't know what to say. You don't got to say nothing. Not to me or anybody else. That's kind of the way this whole thing works, Vito. <laughs> yeah. Now, come on. We don't want to keep him waiting. All right. I'll see you fellas upstairs. What was that all about? Nah, nothing. Just, you know, talking about old times. Like that time when old Leo dropped the soap. Fuck you. All right, all right, all right. That's <laughs> enough. Let's go. These are like two school kids, I swear to God. Eddie is... He's probably like, God, you guys. Right, wait here. Now listen to me, fellas. It's one at a time. Once you're inside, just do as you're told, okay? Joe, come on in. Hey. Good luck. Take a nice freaking... Now, we actually got some great clothes, you know, to do this. Kind of fits what we're getting into. The Mafia. All right, your turn, Vito. Gentlemen, this is Vito Scaletta. Vito, know that this family of ours is a secret. You are entering the Society of the Chosen, a society which does not exist to the rest of the world. Our family means more to you from now on than your own family, or God, or your country. If I ask you to kill your own brother, you must do it. Show me which finger would pull the trigger. Repeat after me, Vito. If I were to betray the secret of our way of life. If I were to betray the secret of our way of life. May my soul burn in hell. Dude, that would hurt so bad. May my soul burn in hell. 
just like this saint. Amico Nostra. Gentlemen, I give you our new friend, Vito Scaletta. Dude, that would hurt so bad. Getting that burning. And, honest men join us. and I'm happy this has happened in the presence of our esteemed guests, especially Don Frank Vinci. And it's you might wonder why I'd take this risk again after spending almost seven years in a can. You see, where I grew up, the only guys who mattered were the guys who had the balls to take what they wanted. You will receive payment for your services from Eddie. Would you like to add anything, Frank? Whatever you do, gentlemen, stay away from the dope. No dope. That's our policy. You can make plenty of money. And after years of doing everybody else's dirty work, I was willing to risk anything to finally be somebody. Okay, why is it uh, being so stupid? I don't know if this is a glitch or if it's supposed to be so quiet, but it is. He's doing some business. Taking cars, getting girls, getting money. Is this my own house now? Okay. Jeez. It was some suits. Okay. Chapter 10. Room service. Villa, Villa Scaletta, June 15th, 1951. There's our sound. All right, everybody, this was Chapter 9 of Definitive Edition of the Mafia 2. We just joined the Mafia uh, officially. So in the next episode, we'll be doing Chapter 10. I think there's three more chapters after t Chapter 10, so 13 total. Um, yeah. So if you guys enjoyed it, make sure you guys do the YouTube thing, like, comment, subscribe, and share your friends. As always, guys, my name is Johnny, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next episode. Bye.